What's going on everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you some of my old abandoned projects on GameMaker. I was going through them today, I thought they were pretty cool, and I figured I'd go ahead and make a video uh, showing them to you guys, and maybe you'll get some ideas for your games. Shout out to Dragonite for actually giving me this idea, so let's go ahead and get into it. Now, I picked out these five projects. I don't know if we'll be able to go through all of them in one video. In fact, there's no way I could go through all my projects in one video, but I picked out these because they were pretty, pretty sweet. Um, let's go ahead and look at the first one. So, look, I wrote a book when I was 10 years old and the main character was this guy named Zayden. So I have these two games called Zayden's Quest and then Zayden's Army. I have other projects with the name Zayden in it. Uh, just because I'm fond of that name, but let's look at Zayden's Quest. And this game was actually based uh, or inspired by a game called Merlin's Quest that I used to play when I was a little boy. And it's an amazing game. Merlin's, no, no, it's called Merlin's Revenge 2. You can look it up on YouTube. There are still people who play it to this day. It's a fantastic shockwave game. <clears throat> so. Press the left mouse button to shoot magic missiles, press space to close. So um, I think I made this project around 2015 or 2016. So yeah, these things work. In memory of Merlin and his revenge, may his memory never die. So there's these little signs here, it's pretty cool. So you can see on the bottom right, here's our map. And this is all that I got done as far as the levels, but it was gonna go all the way to the end of the screen there. Uh, so you can only leave a room after you have killed all the enemies. So uh, you can basically leave a room and it also unlocks the other room. So I think down here was, yeah, my potion. Wish I knew how to use the potions, but I don't. So I don't think I can go through this whole project. Um, Let's see how far we can get in, in a minute here. So here's a friendly little chicken that you can kill. He runs away after you shoot him. Okay. That was Zayden's quest. Okay, let's look at Zayden's army. This is a completely different game. Let's open this up. Here it is. I don't know what this was going to be, but it was going to be something. Again, I worked on this around 2015. So you have these villagers that spawn right here. Now he's running, but I mean, he's not going anywhere. He's not trying to go anywhere. Um, you have your control panel, which you can stop food. I don't know what that does. You can demolish things. You can build, so you can build all these different things, which right now I think you can only build a house. <clears throat> yeah, that's all you can build. You have your stats, which shows nothing. But basically you have these these villagers right here. Oh yeah, that the house adds more to your population. So there are 10 villagers standing right here on top of each other. Then you assign what you want those villagers to do. So if I want people to go harvest lumber, I just create some lumberjacks and they're gonna go and just start doing that. <clears throat> Miners, they will start collecting these stones and then hunters will go after the, <laughs> the rabbits. Um, yeah, so can go ahead and send them all off and that was about it that's as far as I got and I don't know what it was gonna be <laughs> it was definitely gonna be something um, but it's kind of cool right it's kind of cool I mean I'm sure I'd come up with an idea with this okay so yeah the trees come back so they go out and harvest it and then they come back to the granary and uh, yeah that, that was about it <laughs> Zayden's army. Okay, this one I'm actually most proud of, of all my projects. It's actually finished. It looks terrible. The last time I updated this, this was 2015, but I am so proud of this game. It was fun. It was weirdly fun. It looks r so stupid, but it was weirdly fun. Let me turn the music off. Uh, here it is. It's called Cool Village, and you're just you just spawn in this world you have these people walking around this is the outside and you basically have to figure out what to do so uh you have your home down here okay you have your food you can sleep and all that stuff on the on the left control panel you have your money your health energy hunger thirst your job so the first thing you want to do is get a job so let's go do that 
Get a job. You can be a miner or a bounty hunter. Bounty hunter is more fun. So we're gonna be a bounty hunter. Uh, okay, there's a bad guy. So if you're a bounty hunter, crap, he's shooting me. Don't kill me, dude. If you're a bounty hunter, you can take him out. So we're gonna need a gun. So we go to city hall, buy a gun license. Um, okay, bad guy's gone. <clears throat> then we need to get a gun. Where do we get a gun at? Where do we get the gun? Oh, gun mart. <laughs> So let's go to Gun Mart and buy a pistol. Um, there's a cop. So if you do any crime, which there's a lot of crime you can do, uh, the cop will come after you. There's a fully working casino where you can play blackjack, plastic surgery where you can change your face. <clears throat> uh, you can get a car which will change like your city, which has a bunch of other options and stuff to do. You can go to the store to buy some body armor, a pickaxe if you're a miner, you need to get that. Uh, you can fill your fridge. You can uh, go to the police station, see who's your bounty hunter or bounty is, which is this guy, which was already shooting at us. Uh, so there he is. How do I use my gun? <sighs> no, there we go. So I'm gonna shoot this guy. Okay. Oh crap! I just killed a civilian. That's not good. Now I have a bounty on me. You have been killed. Call an ambulance. No. I died. <clears throat> so it's pretty cool. There's a lot of stuff you can do. So let's go ahead and kill someone. I can show you like, uh, so even to get a car, you need a driver's license. How, where's my gun? Oh, I gotta buy it again. Okay. So if I kill some people, <clears throat> and then when a cop comes out, I put my gun away. Yeah, like this, he's gonna arrest me, and then I'm in jail. <laughs> I can't leave. And, uh, and also bounty hunters would come after me too. So you can see I have a bounty of 150. And now I'm out of jail. So that's all I'll show you for that. And I'll end the video with this. So I was so happy with Cool Village and there were people like playing it that were like kind of into it that I was making it online multiplayer. So let's start up the server. Server's online. Let's start up the client. Uh, and here it is, Cool Village, the cool place to live. <clears throat> 2015 enter the village you can create an account I think I already made an account so because I was messing around with this and here's the <clears throat> here's the online version so you can see as a little walking animation it's, it's a different perspective there's your store your burger world uh, and then it's fully working you can sign another client in and everything and play with each other uh, there's a chat room and you can shout Hello there, uh, Wizardy shouts so like more people can hear it. Otherwise, if you just say something, only the people in range can hear it. And then you can whisper, and those only people near you can hear that. So it's like a whole talking system. Uh, your persona, I don't know what all this was, but it's there. You have your inventory, you have a freaking inventory. <clears throat> can I drop things? Yeah, I can drop things, which is pretty sweet. Uh, use, inspect. Uh, I don't know how much of all of this works. Um, yeah, there we go. You see a brown shirt. Inspect. You see a pickaxe. Uh, it can be used to mine ore. So, yeah, you have a whole thing here. Inspect. You see a potion. Uh, and then we have your needs, which is your hunger, thirst, and energy. And then your wallet, which would be your money and your licenses. So like, you know, we had to buy a gun license in the other game and car license and stuff. Store, so yeah, you can go to different rooms. There's nothing in these rooms. Uh, and it all worked. It was all multiplayer online. This was so cool. And uh, yeah, so there it is. There are some of my projects. Uh, that about does it for this video. Uh, you can leave a like if you like this video. Leave a comment if you'd like me to make more of these videos. Um, like I said, I have so many more projects. I have a paintball game. I have all kinds of stuff. Um, I'd love to make more videos if you guys would like me to. Uh, if you haven't already, click that subscribe button. And uh, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. I also have a Patreon if you'd like to support some of my projects. And that about does it. I'll see you guys next video.